For decades, Pluto remained an elusive and enigmatic point of light in our telescopes, a distant world at the edge of our solar system that stirred curiosity and imagination. It existed as a mere speck in the vastness of space, a tiny, pixelated blob at the periphery of our cosmic neighborhood. The images we had were little more than blurry dots, leaving much to the imagination. But in 2015, something extraordinary happened. The New Horizons spacecraft, after nearly a decade-long journey, finally reached its destination. NASA's New Horizons spacecraft completed its epic voyage, unveiling Pluto in all its glory. The images it sent back were breathtaking, revealing a world far more complex and vibrant than we had ever anticipated. What emerged from these high-resolution images was not a barren, lifeless world as we had long imagined, but a dynamic, living planet with a rich and varied landscape. We were greeted by towering mountains, vast plains, and a surprisingly active surface, all challenging our preconceptions of Pluto. It was a place teeming with mysteries, each new image unveiling more about this distant world, and each revelation sparking fresh questions. These initial close-up views captivated the world, reigniting the fascination with the unknown and fueling our desire to explore the far reaches of space. The images of Pluto were not only visually stunning, but they also reignited our sense of exploration. Scientists and the public alike were left in awe of the detailed views of a place that had been largely unknown for so long. This close-up encounter with Pluto opened the door to a flood of questions that would fuel scientific inquiry for years to come. How could a world so small and so far from the Sun exhibit such geological activity? What forces were at play beneath its icy exterior? The mysteries of Pluto's internal heat and geological processes quickly became a hot topic of study, with scientists eager to understand what lay beneath its frozen surface. One of the most striking features revealed by New Horizons was the vast heart-shaped region known as Sputnik Planitia. This sprawling nitrogen glacier, covering hundreds of miles, became an iconic symbol of the mission. The glacier's smooth and youthful surface suggested that Pluto was far more geologically active than we had ever imagined. The absence of impact craters indicated a surface constantly renewing itself, erasing the scars of ancient collisions. But the true enigma lay beneath the ice. Could there be a subsurface ocean hidden beneath this frozen landscape? The idea of a subsurface ocean on Pluto quickly gained traction in the scientific community. Gravity anomalies detected by New Horizons hinted at a denser layer beneath the surface, possibly a vast ocean of liquid water. Despite the frigid temperatures on the surface, the possibility of liquid water remained plausible. This water could be kept warm by the radioactive decay occurring deep within Pluto's core, with the thick icy crust acting as an insulating layer, preventing the water from freezing solid. This discovery raised profound questions about the potential for life beyond Earth, as it suggested that even in the coldest, most distant reaches of the solar system, conditions might exist for life to thrive. Pluto's surface is not a static, frozen landscape, but a dynamic world sculpted by active geological processes. New horizons revealed towering mountains made of water ice as hard as rock, rising several kilometers above the surrounding plains. These mountains stand as a testament to the powerful forces at work beneath the surface. Flowing nitrogen glaciers, similar to glaciers on Earth, were also observed, carving valleys and shaping the landscape. These glaciers constantly reshape Pluto's surface, creating a world in flux, driven by internal heat and possibly tidal forces from its largest moon, Charon. The gravitational interaction between Pluto and Charon, where both bodies are tidally locked, always showing the same face to each other, might provide the necessary forces to fuel Pluto's geological activity and maintain a subsurface ocean. This complex relationship between Pluto and Charon raises intriguing questions about the dynamics of distant worlds. The tidal forces exerted by Charon could be contributing to Pluto's internal heat, supporting geological activity and potentially creating conditions conducive to life. Understanding this relationship is key to unraveling the mysteries of these distant bodies. The discovery of a subsurface ocean on Pluto raises an even more profound question. Could life exist in this frozen, far-off world? While the presence of liquid water does not guarantee life, it is a necessary ingredient for life as we know it. The possibility of life existing in Pluto's subsurface ocean is a tantalizing one, and future studies of the planet's composition and the chemistry of its interior could provide crucial clues. If organic molecules or other biosignatures are discovered, it could revolutionize our understanding of life beyond Earth and the potential for life to arise in such extreme environments. But Pluto's story does not end there. It is not alone in the icy depths of the outer solar system. 
It is part of a vast and unexplored region known as the Kuiper Belt, a frozen archive of the early solar system. Pluto is just one of many icy bodies residing in this remote area, each one a potential treasure trove of secrets about the formation of our solar system. The Kuiper Belt holds countless other objects, many of which may harbor subsurface oceans or other hidden features that could challenge our understanding of planetary evolution and the conditions necessary for life. Pluto's journey has opened our eyes to the possibility that other objects in the Kuiper Belt, some even larger than Pluto, might also possess subsurface oceans, creating environments that could support life. The realization that these distant worlds may be more geologically active than previously thought, with internal heat sources capable of sustaining liquid water beneath their icy crusts, expands our understanding of where life could exist in the universe. It has profound implications for our search for extraterrestrial life and our understanding of how planets and moons evolve over time. The discoveries made at Pluto are just the beginning. While the New Horizons mission provided us with a tantalizing first look at this distant world, it has left us with more questions than answers. To fully unlock the secrets of Pluto, we must return with more advanced tools and a dedicated mission to explore this mysterious planet in greater detail. A future mission could send a lander to Pluto's surface, allowing scientists to sample its atmosphere and ice, or even explore the depths of its subsurface ocean. Such an endeavor would revolutionize our understanding of Pluto, the Kuiper Belt, and the potential for life beyond Earth. In the end, Pluto is a reminder of the vastness and wonder of the universe. It challenges our assumptions and ignites our imagination, encouraging us to look beyond our own world and explore the unknown. Through missions like New Horizons, we are reminded of the importance of curiosity and the drive to explore, qualities that have always been at the heart of scientific discovery. As we continue to study Pluto and its neighbors, we may just find that the universe is more full of surprises and mysteries than we ever imagined.